What diameter of 100 meter long copper wire would have a resistance of 0 0.10 ohms? A few things going on in this problem. First thing we have to do, as always, is look at our given. We want to find a diameter. We have the length and we have the resistance. We need the cross-sectional area. So for a wire, the cross-sectional area is pi r squared. We're not given radius, we're given diameter, so we substitute that r is d over 2, so the cross-sectional area is pi d squared over 4. Don't get tripped up by that. We now have the resistance is rho l over a. The area, here's this pi d squared over 4. Pi d squared over 4 means that 4 gets kicked up to the top, and we have 4 times rho l. To solve for d, we multiply it through by r, in other words, d squared to r, and then we divide through by r, so we'll have 4 rho l over pi r. However, that was d squared up here. We need to take the square root of both sides, and we do that over here. Now we can substitute in the numbers, and the answer we get, if you use a calculator, is 4.6 times 10 to the minus 3 meters and we're just going to go ahead and call that millimeters. So the answer is 4.6 millimeters. <clears throat>